has a newly developed battery pack intelligent charging and discharging machine as smart EV EP260 adopts the most advanced charging and discharging technology, which enables maintenance personnel and managers to maintain and store the battery pack easily and scientifically, thereby extending the service life of the battery module. Then the actual measurement is carried out for a single module of the battery pack. I smart EV EP260 accessories include module communication cable, physical acquisition module output DC positive and negative cable, physical clip cable to 20V power cable. First, connect the DC positive negative pole cable to the corresponding power supply positive and negative poles of the host and the other end corresponds to the battery modules, total positive and negative poles. One end of the module communication line is connected to the in interface of the physical acquisition module. And the other end is connected to the host. Connect one end of the physical clip cable to the physical acquisition module. The clips of the physical clip line are clipped on the battery module in turn. Connect one end of the supplied AC input power cord to the corresponding interface of the device and the other end to connect to the power supply. Close the AC circuit breaker and wait for the unit to turn on. Select Discharge to set the discharge test parameters and protection conditions. Name the test data information. Set the nominal capacity. Select battery type. Set the number of single strings connected when testing the module. Set the battery cell voltage difference protection value according to the actual situation. Set the output current value during discharge operation. Set the discharge duration. Set the voltage threshold of the module group terminal during discharge. Set capacity set and cell end voltage. You can choose to open this item to set discharge capacity ampere hour and single string lower limit voltage protection value. After the setting is completed, click save, close the DC switch, and click start to start the discharge test. In charge mode, the battery information is set the same as in discharge mode. Set the charging voltage target value. Set the upper limit protection value of the group terminal voltage. Set the charge test current value. Set the current threshold. Set the charging time. Set cell high voltage. You can choose to enable this item to set the single string upper limit voltage protection value. When the setting is complete, select Save. Close the DC switch and click Start. 
to start the charging test. When the work is completed, disconnect the DC switch and AC switch.